Welcome back to another reaction to Mr. Villain's Day Off, Episode 8, Gifts in the Season of White. Of course, the episode would start off <laughs> with Mr. Villain interacting with a panda. Why is it removing all of its black spots? Now it's a polar bear. <laughs> He's like, what's going on? Oh, he was trying to shock him. Uh oh, something prompted that dream? What could it be? I love how like he does his chores. There's nothing like a person that has a cleanly place. Okay, he all organized. <laughs> Is he trying to stop from crying or uh, uh, laughing? He can't handle the cuteness. <laughs> he like I need to calm down. Some coffee will help. <gasps> what? No wonder he had that nightmare or that dream. <laughs> He is so like, of course, he doesn't visibly show it because he looks the same all the time, right? That very severe look. But he is upset for sure. Returning the pandas. I mean, of course, it's a good thing they can be in their natural habitat. Right? But characters like Mr. Villain are gonna surely miss them. The music be so like serious. Ooh. What's gonna happen? What what's what's going on? Are they seriously having a orange sculpting competition? A dog or something. <laughs> His laugh is so evil. <laughs> it's a panda orange. No, a, a pandarin. It's a pandarin. <laughs> oh, I thought it was an octopus. They're like, what is going on? Nothing Really? Y'all gonna have to eat all those oranges. Why do I keep calling them oranges? Mandarins. Well, 
their skin game should be on point, okay? All that vitamin C. <laughs> What's going on now? Do you have a headache? Christmas event Huh. So it's Christmas time. Hasn't it already been Christmas time before? Wasn't there an episode about Christmas at some point? So if that's the case, because I don't remember, we've been watching him over the course of a year. <laughs> I love that she has gotten so used to him like he's a loyal customer right and I think she enjoys seeing him find new things in the store to try you know I do too <laughs> He is really contemplating, like, what would I get as a present? What would I gift somebody? Present <laughs> Now, while he's thinking about what he could get to give, right, as a gift, I think if I were to get a gift from Mr. Villain, it would definitely be something panda-related, right? Um, I could see getting him, like, a panda onesie. I think that would be really cute. Um, or some panda slippers. Yeah, I think I, I think I could see that. Especially with it being like winter time. I could see getting him a like a panda a panda fit, right? Panda onesie, panda slippers. Cause I'm sure he already has a mug. I'm sure he already has something for his like keychain. Or or cuz he's always in his trench coat, right? And I know he has that very um simple monochromatic look, but maybe like getting his trench coat tailored so the lining of it has pandas. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I like that one. I like that one. Because that way he can always have, you know, something panda-related on him. Because he's always out and about, right? I like that idea. <laughs> what y'all think? どちらも幸せな気持ちになれる。それがプレゼントなのかもしれないね。<laughs> it's like what's going on like <laughs> it's time to get up
they kill me. They just be looking so mad serious. More mandarins? Yeah, they should definitely share. There's no reason for any of them to be sick, okay? Because they eat mandarins at the wazoo. <laughs> <laughs> like, we don't got nothing for you. Oh, they're so cute. So they're deciding to wait a little longer, right? To open the presents. I will say when I was younger, right? We couldn't open presents until the morning of right but when we got a little older my mom gave us the option to um open one present on christmas eve i don't feel like i i took her up on that because i was just so used to open it the day of and then of course having that anticipation of oh what am i getting you know, I, I still wanted to feel that. So I totally can relate. Just wanted to wait a little longer um, to open your presents. So what? You're never too old for a present. So I'm assuming Black gave the gifts. He didn't get anything. Well, maybe his gift was just seeing the smiles on their faces. Oh no. Oh no. Is this another internal dialogue that he has to work through about something? <laughs> I love it though. He really like he really has to work through he works through a lot of stuff, you know? <laughs>私は北極熊と呼びたい。Okay, so these are like all of the facets of himself advocating for all of the things that he likes. Not the Chinese buns. Okay, it seems like most of them on board. 
Oh, maybe not. Kangaroos, where kangaroos come from? That came out of left field. I didn't even know he liked kangaroos. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, it's the general. <laughs> he has been having some very interesting dreams. Another very cute episode of Mr. Villain's Day Off. Wow. So, I wish they would have focused in a little bit more or gave us more into the pandas being returned. Or maybe it was just conversations being had that they're going to be returned. I don't know. But... If that's the case, what is he going to do? You know what I'm saying? Like, those are his friends. <laughs> All right, y'all. Episode eight is a wrap. I will see y'all next time.